All right, we are live. I'm going to mute this over here. Welcome to our first virtual open house. We are live, uh, having fun. Today we are out at 133 Windgate Close Southwest, and I am going to add uh, Rob Campbell. Rob Campbell, I'm going to add you here. Give me one second. You are live at the house right now. Uh, and uh, oh, look at that smiling face. How are you today, sir? <laughs> oh, it's awesome. Beautiful little sunny day. It's finally spring. It's true. Right? I, well, yesterday was the first day of spring, was it not? That's what they say, March 20, 20th. It used to be March 21st, my birthday. Today is actually my birthday. And uh, I got I got ripped off. Now no longer first day of spring. Well, happy birthday, sir. Damn equinox. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's. Um, I'm gonna quickly show uh, our. Actually, if you if you jump on live, I see that we have a couple of viewers here. If you're live, uh, say hello. See where you're from. We would love to. Um, I'm just kind of moving things around here. We would love to know where you're from. Uh, if you're, you have questions about the house, ask away. Rob's going to give us the tour. But I'm just going to quickly show what it looks like uh, on our website. Uh, here we go. So this is what we're looking at today. Uh, 133 Windgate Close Southwest. Uh, 3699. Uh, this house, you can see down here, is three bedrooms, three baths, 1,853 square feet. Um, I've been told that it has brand new flooring, uh, quite a large uh, deck on the back, uh, single garage attached, I mean really good price uh, for this home. And I want to let everybody know who sees this that uh, we are now offering uh, virtual showings for this home or any homes that you see on our website. So uh, if there's homes that you want to see that you want to get into but you don't physically want to get into, uh, this is a way that you can do that. So. Um, Oh, I lost my mouse. Hold on a second. So, um, here we go. Rob, take it away. Why don't you give us a, a home tour and, uh, and show us around a bit so we can kind of see what this place looks like. You bet. Awesome. So, as Jared said, this house is definitely move-in ready. It uh, has a single car garage. It is a north-facing uh, home. Uh, the Sorry, south facing home north facing backyard as you'll see when you walk in the front door you have a half bath off the front entrance coming in to your laminate floor with a nice big walk-in closet at the front uh, steps down to the basement the basement is undeveloped at this time so ready for your dreams and your inspiration uh, coming into a large entryway uh, leading into the main living room, natural gas fireplace, big open space, nice big kitchen, got all your big island and uh, all your nice appliances ready to go. Uh, the back door, we have another pantry over here with the big space. For you as you come in with your groceries and as Jared mentioned the single car garage uh, lots of space for storage and uh, previous owners have set it up with a few interesting things on the side to help with your tools and whatnot uh, he also did talk about the big massive deck which runs the entire length of the home um, I know from living about a block away this house is going to get lots of sunshine in the evening as the sun does set over in the west over here we'll move on up to the upper level. So Rob, as you're going through there, whereabouts is this house in Airdrie for those that are just kind of getting familiar with the area? For sure. So the, if you're familiar with Airdrie at all, it's the southwest corner. Uh, the newest development that is happening in the city. If, uh, from what they've been rumoring is in the next couple of years, there should be a brand new sports facility, library, high school, over those houses there um, on the further southwest side of, of the community. So in terms of uh, your, your property value, you're guaranteed to go up with all these amenities coming up. Uh, you're a stone's throw to Cooper's Crossing, which has your save on foods, the McDonald's, um, 
Shoppers Drug Mart, doctor's office, dentist, daycare. Uh, you're close to my favorite little restaurant, Sorso. Um, yeah. Fantastic. So upstairs. Just at the top Rob, of the just, stairs, so, you, just so you know, just so you know, we have someone uh, watching from Guatemala right now, and they're a real estate agent. So it's uh, we're worldwide today. Woo! Hey, global, global, global. There you go. Um, so you show uh, us so around the, the upstairs. The top of the yeah. Stairs. Yep, top of the stairs. Uh, right on to the left, you're going to come up to a uh, a secondary bedroom. Uh, good for kids. It's got a big, nice closet little space for your dresser or entertainment center linen closet here on on uh, at, right at the top of the stairs cool coming around to the corner um entering into your half bath upstairs laundry which is awesome to have close to the bedrooms full bath over here another little bedroom for kids or guests a cute little nook here for um you know, maybe kids have a little reading space or a little play and space. That bedroom that's is separate above the from garage, the the right? Bedroom. Just to kind of get a sense of where the house is. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is right over the single car garage. Uh, another big closet behind the door, and then we'll go into the master bedroom. Again, master bedroom is facing north, uh, so you won't get all that sun at the nighttime, but uh, it's definitely uh, pretty awesome space. With the walk, with uh, another walk-in closet here, uh, big double entry doors into the ensuite with walk-in shower, big jacuzzi tub, and more storage for you. So fantastic! Definitely an awesome, awesome-looking home. Like Jared said, it's move-in ready. Uh, located in quiet Windsong. Uh, the only problem is, is if uh, you move in, I'm only a block away, so you might have to see me more, <laughs> more than you like. That's not a bad thing. You're a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, any questions or no. any anybody have any looking looking to see anything specific in the home? Yeah, I mean, there's a few people watching right now, so if you have questions, I mean, feel free to ask live right now. We'll be on for a couple more minutes. Um, but, uh, but this, this video will be living on our Facebook feed as well. So, um, I will put, uh, you can, I will put Rob, uh, Rob's info is actually in the, uh, com or the original, um, post of this video. Uh, but I'll make sure that Rob's email and phone number are in here as well. Uh, head on over to our website. I'll put a link in there as well for this property. So if anyone does have questions, uh, you guys can absolutely, um, just ask away and, uh, and we'll. We'll kind of go from there. So, I don't know. Is there anything else you want to add to uh, to what you're showing us today, Rob? No, just really, honestly, uh, if you've ever thought about Airdrie as a uh, place to call home, it's a great city. Yeah. I moved out here two years ago. It's fantastic. There's so many kids. Uh, this home is probably a 10-minute walk to the skateboard park, Splash awesome. Park, Ball Diamonds. You can walk to get your groceries. They've got walking paths throughout the community, numerous uh, playgrounds and parks for little kids, uh, bigger parks for the bigger kids, uh, close to the amenities that I was talking about. You're about uh, a five-minute drive away from Home Depot, Walmart, uh, some good restaurants. 40th Avenue, they are ex extending and should be linking up with Highway 2 to get you quick access out yeah. of the city if you do work in town. So all in all, I mean, the affordability of Airdrie is amazing. The community yeah. is amazing. And come be my neighbor. Come be my neighbor. There's the sales tag right there. <laughs> with, with, that, with that mop of hair, hair, like I'm just jealous, let's be honest, more than anything. And that smile, <laughs> this house is going to sell. So I woke up like this. Well, yeah, <laughs> me too. Uh, so yeah, so again, so this house, 369.9, I believe, square feet single attached garage. Uh, this is one of our first virtual open houses, um, given the current climate and circumstances that we're in. So, uh, if you've got any questions for Rob, reach out, I'll put his info into the comments. Uh, you can always, uh, go to our website, check out things there as well. I'll put that in there in the comments. Uh, but other than that, uh, we have a couple more that are going to be happening today as well. We're going to be heading over to, uh, let me just double check the actual addresses here. So we're going to be heading over to 
uh, Sage Hill, as well as I believe it's Boness uh, that we're heading down to this afternoon as well. So we have Dallas and Simi at those places. So uh, stay tuned. If you're in your home and you're isolated and you can't get out, well, this is the way that you can tour some fantastic homes for sale that just hit the on or just came on the market. So uh, other than that, I think we should let let everybody go. En See you. En enjoy your day, everybody. See you, Rob. Play safe. Bye-bye. See ya.